This video was shot in early March of 2020, like a day or two before everyone got locked away for the rest of the year. I shot this and never released it, as I didn't think anyone would care to see a video about something I thought or wanted to do. But with my computer that had all of my video files for the Star Wars smithing video that I was supposed to put out today locking up on me, I figured this might be better than nothing, but who knows. It was a warm, end-of-winter day, and all I could think about was the sea. Being on the ocean in any capacity is what I long for. I miss surfing. I miss sailing. I miss the smell of the salt and the spray, and the sound of the surf, the vast sky. One dream project of mine is to build a ship. A long ship. I want to build it and crew it with a motley sort of people. Those rare folks who still have grit. The people who are not scared, like most of the world, to be uncomfortable. We would sail up the coast of the United States and pass by Canada, and leave for open water to cross to Newfoundland. We'd sail sailing up and around to get to Lanzo Meadows, which was a small station the Norse had to fix ships. We would make landfall and storm our way into the nearest bar for a tall pint, and eat red meats in silence and just look at each other with a small smile. We had done it. We had made the trip. No thoughts of going home or what's next, just beer, meat, and each other. The locals would welcome us because we are, well, awesome. Who doesn't like awesome people? After we stay a few days and had our fill of the party and local fare, we would find a place to camp and say our farewells, but not before going and setting our ship on fire. We would watch it burn in the cold North Atlantic Ocean, sending our fires rebellious into the night, rebellious against the cold, rebellious against the unlived life, rebellious against comfort and conformity, we who have agreed not to be wasted to the passage of time. Being among those weak hearts that are content to count not the sands on the beach that they land on, but the sands that drop through the hourglass of impending death with a coward's eye. We will show the sky it is not just the stars that can shine bright into the darkness. Our light being greater as we make the choice to shine. Before that, I need to learn how to build a ship. So I want to make a small 12-footer to sail on the nice large lake that is only five minutes from my house. I have the skill to manage a boat on the open ocean, but half of this is having the skill to build an ocean-worthy vessel. That, I don't know. So this small boat will be a project I work on here and there. If you all want to see it, that is. And maybe we will see if this idea can become more than just a dream. And maybe it can be plucked out of the ether with sweat and blood, and be made manifest by our collective wills and strengths. I suppose time will tell.